So the other half of my argument now would look at the corporate life and looking at how many CEOs they got it, you know, from our point of view, they have it good because they can pay all these people. We are struggling to even have, you know, health care benefits that you're still going to pay out the ass for the prescriptions, you know, as well as, you know, you're still paying 50 to to $100 on co-payments just to see the doctor. So it's just getting hair-raising to get some sort of health care where it is cut down for workers after 90 days, whether they're part-time or full-time, because you do need a healthy workforce. Because now, as we're watching all these other companies, we got tainted pet food. And then, of course, you send your pet to the vet. Well, there is a $1,000 right down the tubes. So it's just getting to a point that, yeah, we're the biggest, baddest country, but... <laughs> We certainly haven't gotten away from red tape, so that's why a few of the people I've met over the years, you know, look at me and I go, what am I supposed to do? I'd rather live, you know, out in the middle of the jungle, because at least then I know what needs to be done every day. Get up, go out, tend the fields if that's what I do, or, you know, in certain remote areas, go out there and hunt, bring it back. You're already tired, so there's others that are, you know, kept the camp going. You know, they'll go ahead and prepare the food, and the only thing you'll do is eat and keep watch to make sure no other critters come. And if they do, then you kill them, and then there's more food for you to eat. Seems like a simple life, but we're doing it in a totally different fashion. Going out there hunting for a job, and then you don't know if it's going to come to fruition. And better on hunting, because as soon as you see that animal, there's only one of two things. It's going to escape you, or you're actually going to get it. And on certain points, you are going to get that animal. Now, as far as a job, you're waiting on somebody else with a thinking mind to say yes or no. And then if it's a no, you got to go to somebody else and start the whole process over again. And then after a week of that, you get tired. And that's where I come back to the women that if you want to complain, do the same thing. Some of you have it easy to be the front desk people because it's somehow still ingrained within the model of Americans that women are going to be at the front desk. So you all have it easy. Now, if you want to move up, well, yeah, you can take some courses or, you know, go to the library, do your research on your job, and then you can step up when you show the initiative. So, all it is, if you have the initiative, but then you don't have the right avenue to follow, or the tools, how are you going to get it done? I've gotten three people back in Colorado that I want to take a baseball bat to their head going, I've got this video camera, I would like to get into producing with a company, but how can I go through that if they say they don't have the funds or the slots available to take me in as an intern. So, I'm doing this. I like it. I'm not nervous right now. I'm rambling, yes, but that's what I have done before and I'm doing it again. <clears throat> so, is it going to come to fruition to be a paying job? I don't know. It depends upon somebody out there that will just go ahead and say, I like what he's doing. Subscribers, Thank you. If there's somebody that you know that can help that's over in New Jersey, tell them to give me a holler, and I'll holler back. I'm sitting here doing nothing, and I would like to do more reporting <coughs> with all the demonstrations, because young people, you need to then be informed. Just don't sit there and think, because a lot of times you can think, but then what do you have to back it up with? going out and hearing from others, these people that state that, oh, 9-11 was not an inside job, well, you kind of got to really look at all the evidence. Well, that evidence was swept away real fast. Trust me, I've been to the pit so many times that I'm looking at it from when I used to run around through there traveling to now looking at it going like, no, I don't believe the stories anymore. It was an inside job somehow, some way, because I went, I looked. Now, 
did I go to the library and look at it? No, because I've heard the stories. I've been up, you know, in the observatory, seen, you know, how they built it. Check every avenue, and then you'll come to a conclusion. Same thing with religion. You know how you feel when you're at church, no, or synagogue, or however you pray. But when it comes to others, you can't push. That's the only one I can state you shouldn't do. I do have a Christian background, but I am not Christian. I still believe in the man that is our Savior, because he made a sacrifice. Just like the people that are over in Iraq right now, that are doing their job, I respect them because they're doing their job. I respect the man that's not here anymore, that a lot of stories were written about. And now it's to a point, why do we push all this stuff down people's throats when the common sense and the obvious should be the first thing done? Everybody needs food, a roof over their head, and a warm place to sleep. Can it be any simpler? Well, <clears throat> our governments have made it very hard for us in all of the countries that have problems. Now, there are other countries that you don't hear too much because they have worked out their problems. What's it going to take? That's why I ask. You tell me. So that then I can continue a story. I can give you fluff. That's what I've been doing for however many minutes so far. Fluff. So, let's try to get something serious going. Whether it, you know, even talking about the way computers are right now. I know, like I said before, I'm on a Mac. You might be on a PC. You might even be using your cell phone to do your videos. So, I'm with a regular digital video camera. I've got my Mac. Everything goes smoothly. It might go smoothly the way you know and understand Windows. So, fluff. Fluff. How much fluff can you take?